puja firms up a plot of land in the shape as shown in the diagram of the right. Given that BD is 5 cm, so whereas BD this one is 5 cm, BC is 7 cm, and CD or CD CD is 8 cm, and AE is 12, so AE is 12 cm and BDE ADC are straight lines. Calculate the area of the land fenced up by Puja. So we see here this area. So if we have all three lines, we can just use Heron's formula. So uh, semi perimeter is equal to so 5 plus 8 plus 7. So, this is the perimeter divided by 2. So, we get 10. So, the area. So, this one is the first one. This one is the second one. This one is the third one. So, area of the first one is equal to. So, this semi-perimeter, we take 10. And then, we take 10 minus all sides. So, 10 minus the first side is 5. And then, here is 10 minus 8. And this one is 10 minus 7. So, we get equal to 17.3205. So, we get the first one is 17.3205. So, we see here, when we have all lines, when we have all lines, we can get this state angle. So, when we get this angle, we know this one is straight line, then we can get this angle. So, to get this angle, we use cosine rule. So, cosine rule, cos theta so this cos is equal to so we see here theta in between two lines so the opposite of the angle is here 7 so we take 5 square plus 8 square minus the opposite of the angle which is 7 square divided by 2 times 5 times 8 which is equal to 0 0.5 so theta is equal to cos inverse 0 0.5 so we get sixty degree so we have sixty degree here which means this one is sixty degree and this one is equal to hundred twenty degree so to use area so before you need to use area you need to find angle in between two lines where you know these two lines or you have all lines so you have angle here you have angle here and you have 12 here so if you get this line or you get so we see here we have 12 here so this one is one opposite set so if you if you have one opposite set then we can use sine rule then we can find a d so we see here a d so, the opposite of AD is angle 40, sine 40 is equal to, this one we have 12 over sine 60. So, AD is equal to 12 over sine 60 times sine 40 which is equal to. So, this one is 8.9067. So, now you have two lines and you can find this angle. Because you have 60 and 40. So, this angle, let it be x. So, x is equal to 180 minus 60 minus 40. So, 60 and 40. So, you get 80. Now, you have... Now, you have angle in between two lines. So, area is equal to half a, b sin c which is equal to half a is so this one is 12 and this one is 8.9067 sin 80 so we get this one is 6 52.628 centimeter square so you see here we have this one, the first area, so the first area is equal to, this one is 17.3205. This one is second and this one is third. So here, we get the third one which is equal to 52.628. So we need to find the second one.
so we see here for a b d here so we have if i pull out this one is a b d so we have this line which is 8.9067 and we have this line which is 5 cm so we know this angle is 180 minus 60 which is 120 so we can calculate area so area is equal to half a b sine c which is equal to half so this two line is 8.9067 times 5 sine this is 120 120 so we get Nineteen point two eight three six. So this one is nineteen point two eight three six. So we have one, two, three. So total area is equal to area one plus area two plus area three. So you add it up three, then you get eighty nine point two three two centimeter square.